What's up everybody? It's Hayes here, and we're back with Spyro, Year of the Dragon. Uh, so, funny story, I went to go play it this morning, um, and nothing saved. So I had to go back and redo everything. Uh, but in redoing everything, I found a few things. I found another egg, I went and did the timed uh, lizard catching, because I know how much of a pain in the ass that can be. And also in my travels, I got a few more uh, gems, so we actually have enough to unlock Sheila now. So we're gonna do that. Fortune to keep Sheila the kangaroo locked up. <laughs> the pesky animal must have been causing a lot of trouble for that poor sorceress. I suppose I could accidentally let the kangaroo escape if you were to pay me, say, a small fee. I I'm pretty sure he is the only ah, reason you collect gems. Spyro, I love your sweet naivete. Your kind-hearted nature might be your downfall someday, but for the time being, it's making me rich. <laughs> Shut up! Nobody likes you, Moneybags. Oh, but I do remember this part. Uh, <laughs> I hope you appreciate this favor I'm doing in letting you out. As good of you, mate. No hard feelings, eh? Right. After all, I'm just doing my job. <laughs> <laughs> Can you be one of them dragons then? Yeah, name's Spyro. Never thought I'd see one. You dragons used to rule this entire world, you know. Then all of a sudden you left. Poof. Dragons used to live here? Didn't you know? They say it was over a thousand years ago, I think. And they just left? Yeah, and the weird thing is, after they left, all the magic in the world just sort of went with them. I mean, they say this world used to have magic coming out the wazoo. Flying ships, singing forests, wishing stones, you name it. But when the dragons left, it all just dried up. Is that why some of the portals don't work? Yeah, they're starting to fade out too, one by one. Well, I gotta get back home and do some damage control. Come visit any time you like. Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll play uh, the first Sheila level here, and then maybe we'll play one other world. Uh, while I was in the first world, I found actually another Sheila level, so we can probably play that for the next one, but we'll start with this one for today. Thanks again, Spyro. Now I have to find out what that nasty sorceress has done to my home while I was locked up. Oh, oh, I thought it was going to attack me. <laughs> while you were gone, a bunch of Rhinox kicked us out of our houses. It's okay, though. I love the accent. I are working on a clever plan to take them back. Like, I'm pretty sure that's like one of the most stereotypical <laughs> Swedish accents you can do. I can jump high! Spyro, Bobby, and Pete up there using your air harp. Yes, up easy. there. Just press the X button again at the top of your jump. Oh, okay, we shall use the, the jump at the top of the jump. Ho ho ho! Oh, we are up here now, yeah. Oh no, it's a Rhinox. Get the fuck out of here! No! Oh! Damn it! Ha! What does these guys? Oh, not that they say. Die, bunnies! Oh, those are bunnies. Those are those are birds. I'm good at animals. What these guys say? Really steep cliffs like this one with your double jump. Press the X button to jump and press it again exactly when you hit the ground to do the double jump. Once you've mastered it, you can go anywhere you want. <laughs> Land this and get all these. Ooh, a purple one! What is that? I think that's like 10. Oh, you know, we get purple ones all the time. What am I saying? I'm crazy. Whoop. Nope. Whoop. There we go. What does this guy say? Uh, home at last. Billy the Mountain Goat. Yeah, I was saving this to make an omelet, but I think we deserve oh, it. Oh, God. More. Can you imagine you go to make an omelet and there's like a freaking baby dragon in there? I guess it would cook itself. <laughs> How did it get the bow on its head? That's just not logical now, is it? What's up here? Yay, more! I guess they coins. That's the wrong game. We're not playing Mario. Not today, we're not. What are these guys saying? Eh, we talked to you. Last time we tried to get past this moose, he knocked Billy <laughs> clean through a wall. If you don't mind, we'll just hang out here while you give him a good kicking. 
Well, you know, being Canadian, we are very accustomed to having to get rid of moose. Let's see here. Ah! Oh, we got it. That was a little bit scary. Let's Rhinoc out of the way. Get this going. Get some nice gems. Oh, is that a hunt? No, it wasn't a hunter. What does this guy say? Sheila, let's play a joke. Takes his egg and smash it on Billy's house, okay? <laughs> I need to get him back for the last time he butted me off the cliff. <laughs> They're such jerks to each other. I love how in this game, it's it's a kid's game. But it's <laughs> there's quite a bit of, you know, craziness and there's some little darker tones. Like I, when I went back and played the first level, it showed that the chicken actually got killed by the rhinox and he was like eating it. That's a little bit dark for kids. Oh, you got me. But at the same time, this game was like, like this was this was my childhood right here. What does this guy say? Those Rhinox have taken over. There'll be no stopping them unless we can smash the huts. The huts are too big to smash with your kick attack, though. Try using your stomp attack to smash them instead. I'll confuse them with taunting while you stomp the huts, okay? You remember how to stomp, don't you? Just jump, then press the triangle button in the. Isn't it a little bit mean that we're just, you know, what if these Rhinox are just like friendly miners that, you know, we're just pissing them off because we're just coming to their, their shit and uh, a freaking giant kangaroo stomps their houses to oblivion. I mean, if a giant kangaroo came over and blew up my house, I wouldn't be very happy. I might hit them with a pickaxe. Oh, they'd probably beat me up. Either way, I wouldn't be very happy. Ah, it'd probably be that one kangaroo that was all over the internet with like the huge muscles, but <laughs> the fight me bro kangaroo, that, that would probably be the kangaroo. Getting all these guys. I don't, yeah, actually, I don't think there, I can't remember any other uses for the gems other than to unlock the other characters. If you ever forget how to control a character or vehicle. Okay, I don't think we really need to worry about that. Thank you, Zoe, though. If I ever forget how, I'll let you know. This was a help, Sheila. You can have this egg I found in my house. <laughs> Ta-da! One guy's trying to break out. Oh, I got, we got all the eggs! Yay! Well, let's get these guys right here. Oh, I missed. Wonky. Oh, it's just a one. Why did I do it for a one? That's just ridiculous. Whoop. Ooh. That is this. The fuck? Did she just come out of the tree? Oh, it's real sneaky. Spyro looked so sad. Ooh, look out, Hunter. It's the scary sorceress. I've warned you already. This place isn't safe for small dragons and pussy cats. <laughs> Thanks, but I think we can look after ourselves. Try looking after this. And Hunter's dead. She killed her. Oh, no. <laughs> Come back when you finish witch school, okay? Say, is it just me, or is she kind of cute when she's angry? <laughs> oh, Hunter, you man whore. Okay, finished up the Sheila level, I believe. Ah, we should have time for one more. Let's go and get this one. I think this is the cloud. Yeah, cloud spires. Let's do this one. Okay. Let's see. I remember this one being a bit of a pain in the ass. Okay, let's just talk to this little fairy guy here. The Rhinox have shut down our cloud Nimbus. generator, and I'll never see a rainbow again. Oh. Let's make rainbows! By hitting big green buttons, we make the rainbows up here. Do 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 do! Yay! Nope! If my wings were big and strong like yours, I could easily glide across here. 
easily glide across here. Whee! I know these guys are immune to fire because they have a metal shield. I mean, that doesn't really make sense because, I mean, if you're holding a metal shield and someone, you know, had a flamethrower that was blowing on it, I'm pretty sure you'd burn your hands off. But, you know, video game logic. The metal oh. armor those enemies are wearing protects them from your dragon flame. If you hold down the square button, you can defeat them with your charm. Oh, thank you, Zoe. I like how she tells me that after I've already clearly defeated a few. Oh, no. I'm not. Oh, I'm bad. Oh, okay. Oh, God. I like how they take the time to taunt me. Might as well just teabag me. How about that? No! Ah. Mm. Stop it! It's not nice. He's guarding an egg. Stephanie, we have freed you. Go free and prosper. Oh no! Well, well, if it isn't my favorite dragon, another beach. Chris has put me in charge of guarding these bellows. However, I suppose I might look the other way if I was distracted by counting oh gems. My God. Yes, take two hundred gems. Oh, yes, precious, precious gems. Oh, well, then, Spyro, <laughs> you may now <laughs> use the bellows any time you wish. Oh, Best thank of you. luck on your little egg hunt. He's going a little bit golem on us there. He's thinking. Oh, but now! Yes. Thank you. At the very top of your jump. Headbutt the shit out of these guys. Ah! Oh, I think the time to laugh. Not very good, apparently. Nope. Oh, you activated the bellows? Maybe I can get the cloud generator working again. Yeah, maybe. Huh. Do we got clouds? Do we got clouds? Clouds! Oh my gosh! Oh wait, no, that was an egg. Well, we got clouds again! Yay! The Rhinox must have been using this thing to clock up the cloud generator. They must have. Poor, poor Henry. He was just stuck <laughs> right in the cloud generator. Okay. So why did she leave? She just went back to my home place instead of staying in hers. Well, what's this? Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. What is it, though? Oh, I think this is the one... Oh, let's see. We usually wake up our rain cloud at the crack of dawn, but these mischievous spirits are stopping our bells from ringing. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. No! Son of a bitch, I was so close! There we go, six. Wake up, Mr. Cloud! We need you to awaken. I don't know why. Was it Rain Cloud? Was that what he is? Oh, it's kind of scary. A little bit menacing there, Mr. Cloud. Do you want this doodad? It fell out of the belfry. <laughs> yes, I would like the doodad, thank you. Oh, his name is Jake. Not doodad. Okay, you hear that? Nah, 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 nah. Okay, those guys... Are these little jerks? Here they are, and they run away from you, and they take friggin' forever to catch. Usually, and you gotta like figure out the way that they run because if you go in front of them, oh hey, look at me go! I guess it's not as hard as I remember. Well, never mind then. I take that back. Okay, awesome. Well, I think that's enough for this episode, guys. So for the next one, I'm pretty sure that there's another level we can do in here. Uh, I think it's this one where you have to get these seeds or something. We'll play that one in the next episode. For now, everyone have an awesome day. Hit that like button and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.